Howdy and hello and welcome back to Mike's Game Domain. This is Mike and we are riding on top of Mothership here. The beautiful Brontosaurus with a platform saddle on her back and we are currently having Ash hitch a ride on the back. <laughs> Which is kind of fun actually. So uh, what you can do with these that I've noticed, I, if I set Ash to passive so she doesn't freak out and attack everything, you can actually have um, birds just land on the back and hang out and that way if you need to fly away you can which is pretty cool these guys can be mobile tele uh mobile basically helipads or landing strips for your birds which i think is really cool if you set some of these up strategically around the map it'll basically bounce from one to the other maybe set up a smithy or whatever storage and uh kind of go and have mobile fortresses so i am really hungry so i'm eating i apologize Oh, come on. Really? Wow, that's stag oh, level 80, that's why. Go away. Yeah, you can hit stuff way before it can hit you. It's really, really quite powerful of an attacker. So I'm still obviously on the hunt for, um, for the uh, Paki, the new dino. But um, what I'm trying to do, Oh my god, it's stuck on my tail, or stuck on the saddle or something. What I'm trying to do is level up- uh oh, uh oh, I lost Ash. Crap. 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 Yeah, what I'm trying to do is level up the Bronto here so I can get some more movement speed so I can actually freaking do stuff. I'm stuck on a rock. Yep, I'm complete. No, I'm stuck on Ash. Ash, move for the love of God. There you go. Go kill. Go kill stuff. I'll have Ash level up. Oh man, these things do not turn around. Oh man, Ash is gonna get bum rushed by two Bronos. Not good. Let me help you. Okay, we're good here. Got a Dimorphodon. Ash killed a... No, I killed a Brano. Killed a Stego. And we got more stuff. Parasaur. Okay, Dodo. Come on, Brano. Come on, Ash. You can do it. I want Ash to finish this one. There you go. Beautiful. So there's a ton of carcasses. So, of course, I'm fighting with herbivores, so... I'm not able to harvest this meat, so there's just blood and guts everywhere. Um, the problem is that your bird gets stuck underneath the platform, so that is an issue. I actually don't know a good way to get off this thing. I guess the tail? Um, yeah, I'm thinking that jumping down is a bad idea. Actually, that was a bad idea. Oh, we get to eat jerky for the first time. Yay! <laughs> So there's our jerky. All right, so we can build a few things here. I kind of want to just experiment with what's possible. Let's start with a wall. That's about all I can build. Do I need to build a foundation? Oh, I do. That's a bummer. Maybe I could build pillars and do that whole thing. Um, attack, whatever's attacking you. Dimorphodon, okay. Okay, um, ash, uh, whatever. Let's see. What do I need for pillars? I need... Do I not have pillars? I don't. Yeah, since I reset my character, I don't quite have all the same... Oh, I kind of want to do slope stuff. Wait, I need thatch walls. Okay. Sloped thatch roof. Interesting. Um, sloped wooden type stuff. I could do fence foundation. What I want is pillars, though. Like a wooden pillar. Hatch frames. All right, so I got some some of my building supplies back. All right, so I can build. I want to see what these are all about. Where's my pillars, though? I need more wood. I don't think the um, Bronto is particularly good at harvesting wood, actually. Well, it does okay, obviously. I've been swinging my tail a lot, though, to be fair. Some wood and thatch, and f I'm probably going to be hurting for fiber, which is crazy, because 
My Gigantos have about a million fiber on them. Alright, so I can build pillars now. Oops, pillars are at the top. Let's build a couple of those. Let's build a foundation. I just want to kind of experiment with this stuff. See what I can do. Let's build a couple pillars. We need just regular ceilings, honestly. Oh yeah, I wanted to see about these. Wooden ceiling. Okay. Alright, so that's good enough. It's a good start. Let's play around with this. Let's see what we can do. Let's grab the fence foundation. Okay, I can build fence foundations. That is good. Let's just stick that right there. Cool. So I could build now a wall. I believe. Wooden wall. Yeah. So now I can build a wall there. It's backwards, but whatevs. Uh, cool. That's a thing. All right. So let's build. Um, let's build the pillar. This is what I'm. Yeah. Oh wow! I didn't. You could. You could snap walls to things. Or snap pillars to walls, but they don't seem to want to build. So for the pillars, I want to see what I can get away with here. Nice. Alright, so there's that. Let's go ahead and build a layer of... We only have one ceiling. We're going to need more ceilings. Cool. And... Pillar. Oh yeah, I keep doing that. I keep going to my my thing. Um, wait, what am I doing? Oh, I need more ceilings. I need more wood. Um, yeah, I could build thatch, but okay, whatever. Uh, what I do want to see is, can I build ramps off the sides of the the thing? No, not really. Although, I don't think you can do that anyway. Yeah, you, you definitely can do that, actually. Aha! You can! Interesting. Hmm. This is very curious to me. I'm very curious indeed. How would I want this to go? Maybe like that, and then I can come up here. Start building a base. Interesting. I don't think I definitely don't want fences. I just wanted to see if that would work. Um, I would love. Let's see what the slanted stuff's like. Let's see. I've got. I got this. Let's just throw it down. I'm gonna destroy it anyway. Okay. How do I turn it? Is there any way to rotate it? Hmm. No. You don't really get to choose which direction it goes. Yeah. I want it. I want it. Is there not? There should be a rotate. Uh, hmm. Turn? No. Yeah, I don't see it. Craft slot item modifier. Interesting. Left alt. Okay. Well, that does something. Uh, let's try putting this in our seven and let's just go ahead and do this just to get everything out there all right so let's try this seven alt seven. Oh, no of course that crafts another one well um that's a thing okay let's do that interesting let's do so what if we wanted to do sloped that roof? What's the difference between a sloped thatch roof and a regular thatch roof? I figured you would just put the regular roof on, but I guess not. Oh, okay. So it only needs one. Oh, I could do that instead of a ramp. Can I? Ah, oh, I can. Interesting. Let's try that. Let's see what that's like. Because that looks like it's only one height. So why even build the ramp at all? You can just do sloped roofs. Wait, is it, it's not going away from it, is it? Huh. Why is it going the wrong direction? Oh, wait. What in the world? Yeah, building in this game is a, is a little bit weird. I'm not going to lie. 
is quite odd. Um, I could do that, and then then I could kind of come up this way. I don't know. It's weird. Um, can I then build a? What is this? This is a sloped. Okay. Huh. So it doesn't quite work the way you would want it to. In fact, it's pretty weird. I'm not quite sure what to do with this. Um, I mean, yeah, I see that you can do that. The question is, can I build the other one the same direction? Because if I can only do one, it's going the wrong way. You see this? Maybe if I put the roof down... Uh, wait, what is it? Eight? No, that's the ramp. Um, sloped roof. Did I not build one? Wooden sloped roof. Uh, it's so hard to tell everything apart. There's the wooden roof. Okay, so the sloped wooden roof and the wooden roof are literally the same picture. They're identical. That's a problem. Um, I'm guessing they're gonna fix that, but that is a serious problem. There's no way to tell them apart. So this is this. Oh, okay, there it is, number nine. All right, so let's do that. Okay. So now we have now we have that, and now what I want to see is what it's obstructed. Why can't you obviously put it where it needs to go? I don't understand. What in the world? Is it because of this? What? Oh. Crap. Well, that's fun. <sighs> so the sloped walls are weird. Oh, that's a bummer. Um, Alright, I'm going to have to get my other pteranodon over there. Ugh. <sighs> Yeah, that's a problem. I guess you could build, um... I guess you could build, um, ramps off the sides, and then, like, um... Or maybe ladders down the sides, so you can actually get off the thing without dying, but it's really hard to get off the brontosaurus. They really need to make the, um, the building snapping a lot easier. It's really, really tough. It's it's unnecessary to be like that. I mean, you could simplify the whole system and make it work. So, other games have done have accomplished this. Mm. Let's enjoy this brief nacho break. We should be there here in a second. I'm gonna pause. Sorry. And we're back. And here's my brontosaurus. And. Somewhere is my dead body. Are you my dead body? I think I might have saw... Oh, wait. There it is. God, it already decayed? No. There we are. Let's take all. We're not going to mess with this stinking... Uh... Let's get on Sky Blast here. So now we have Sky Blast and Ash. Um... So both my on. So I don't want to die again, because if I do... If I do, I'll take the Argentavis, which is not as fast. Alright, I'll be right back. And we're back. If you ever wondered why one person playing solo needs 15 high-level Pteranodons, you now know why. <laughs> Freaking fall damage is out of control in this game. They really need to tone it down, in my opinion. Alright, so can I land? Oh my god, if I die. Okay. God. Alright. Let's get on the thing. <laughs> That's super funny, though. <laughs> Angel's just, like, wiggling in the background. Ooh, an egg. Mm, don't care. Alright, so... I've now got movement speed up to 175. Weights up. Uh, stamina... I don't know. Oh, there's a knight. Beautiful. 
You know what I think I'm gonna do is fly on a Pteranodon and just have everyone follow. Cause uh, I don't really enjoy driving such a slow creature. I haven't seen any packies. I haven't keeping my eyes open. But I think we're g we are gonna walk Mothership home. And the reason why is that I continually fall off while building. Oh no, my dead body. Um, everyone stop. Everyone just hang out here for a second. Whoops. All my stuff. What am I doing? Okay, I think that was my old dead body right there. Yeah, I need my new dead body. Um, move. Which is... somewhere? Oh, finding your dead body is impossible in this game. It's absolutely impossible. Um, crap. Alright, just for the sake of this, I'm going to turn my ground clutter all the way off. There we go. That's way easier. Is that my new one or my old one? I can't remember. Alright, that's that's the other one. And then I should have a second body. Oh, there we go. Yeah, I would have never found that in a million years had I not turned off ground clutter. Take all. There we go. Let's go ahead and armor up. <laughs> Goodness. Alright, so there's that, and then... Yeah. You Feel free to eat my dead bodies, uh, Dilo. Don't care. Free lunch. Alright, let's grab our creatures, have them follow me. We're just gonna take... Anyway, we're gonna take Mothership home, because uh, I want to experiment with her and building, but I seem to be falling off quite a bit, which is obviously a problem, so... I'd rather be messing around with her um, at home. I can always take her back to another part of the island um, at, at some later point. So that's what's going to happen now. I'm going to go ahead and pause. Unless I see the new dinosaur, I'm just going to uh, pause until I get all the way back home. So I'll see you in a second. And we're back. And uh, I haven't quite made it to base. I'm just about to the, um, to the metal base here. And I've just been kind of screwing around, honestly, uh, killing stuff and having fun. I went ahead and uh, I went ahead and tamed a Waptor. <laughs> so say hello to Waptor. Hey, Waptor. Uh, Waptor's super cool with black colors and green and gold. Really, really awesome. And um, yeah, Waptor's just gonna eat eat some stuff and things. Good job, Waptor. No, but what I ended up doing, this little, if you remember, this corner had a bunch of Brontos on it, and they were uh, low level. I decided to go ahead and tame a couple, so I have two of them in the works here. Uh, they didn't take very many arrows because they are low level. And um, I just figured, you know, if I'm going to start building on these on these platforms and, and doing kind of mobile bases, I'm going to want more than one. And also I figured I don't really care if it's a super high level Bronto or not because I just want to beef up movement speed. Um, you know, I guess weight's not as big of a deal as I as I imagined. As I imagined it to be. There we go. Um, so, eh. So anyway, I don't know. I don't know what I'm doing. Uh, I'm just killing stuff because, again, this is how you get new dinosaurs to spawn is... Uh, by eliminating some of the old ones. So that's just kind of what I'm doing. Um, but anyway, yeah, so I figured, you know, why not bring in a kind of a few... Um, a f oh, that's a big gash. Uh, why not bring in a few um, Brontos if I'm going to take the time to walk them back, which is horrible, which I'm currently doing anyway. Might as well walk back more than one. Otherwise, I'm going to be doing this over and over again. Wapta! Yeah, and then Waptor was across the beach over here, like right there. I just decided to tame it, because why not? I think taming it takes it away from the spawn queue as well. I don't know, actually, that's a good question. Oops, where'd he go? Got him. Kill. Kill everything. Kill everything. What level are you? Can always use more good... Um, more good pteranodons, but uh, not you. You do not pass the test to become a Spartan. So I must throw you off a cliff. 
Holy God, I'm sitting on a towel and it's like crinkled up. I think I'm getting bruises on my legs. Oh, probably should get exercise instead of playing this game for several hours. It takes forever to do anything though. What are you gonna do, right? Oh, come on. Come on. Well, it doesn't seem like we're gonna see the new dinosaur this episode. I kind of figured as much. I haven't been playing. I've only been playing for about two hours since the release. And that's not normally enough time to get new spawns in. So, like I said, I've been killing everything in sight trying to do this for you guys. But uh, it hasn't quite happened yet. I think I have a, I have a cool idea. I don't know if it's going to work. But I have a cool idea for this purpose. And uh, I'm going to be working on that. I'll probably do it off camera and then I'll give you a reveal of what I did. Yep, more death, more decay, more destruction. Come on, how long do these things take? Yuck, no piranhas. I already took out the piranhas. Alright, so you are almost done. Almost done. You're almost done as well. Yeah, okay. And you got plenty of food? Yes. Okay, cool. So, yeah, they're almost done. Just, I guess, give it a second here. Um, you know what? I'm just gonna pause because uh, I'll, I'll unpause when the uh, when the guys come back. And we're back, and we've got both our Bronos tamed up now. Took about five more minutes. Uh, we're all jammed up. Uh, how do I get rid of these things? How do I do this? Everyone follow um, mothership, and then mothership. You follow me. Okay, yeah, there we go. So Mothership is following the Pteranodon. Everyone else is following Mothership. And that is good enough for me. I love the fort on the back is just like wobbling around. I wonder how high it'll let you build. That's going to be the next thing. Like, will it let you build like 10 stories up and just have it just giant vertical tower on the back of this brontosaurus. That'd be kind of awesome. Oh crap, they get jammed up on this rock every time. Yep. Alright, so I'm not going to make you watch this, but I just wanted to show you the two brontos are up and we're going to walk them back to base. I'll see you back at base. And we're back. And uh, we've just about made it home. We're here at the gate. Man, I gotta say, moving these brontosauruses is a horribly slow and frustrating experience, so... Um, it ended up just being better to go on foot and let him follow me on foot because the uh, the flyers are just way too fast It's like unreasonable for them to even keep up Cool, so Mothership is back at base. I've got a little bit of a building on her. Not really what I want, but uh, At least kind of the beginnings of so now I have some brontosauruses to keep my spinosauruses happy Let's tell everything to stop and um Let's go ahead and close the gate and grab Sky Blast here. There we go. Alright, so let's grab Mothership. Let's go ahead and. Oh, she leveled up. Um, weight's pretty good, honestly. Could probably use more, of course, but. Uh, weight or movement speed? Movement speed. These things are just so slow. I don't think these other Brawners have leveled up. No. Okay, so let's set them all to Wandering. Let them just do their thing. Have fun. We'll, go ahead and, we'll even tell Mothership to Wander. Uh, now my birds and my Pterodactyls are not going to be Wandering, I don't think. Oh, I need to tell the Raptor to Wander. Raptor, how do you get hurt? Huh. That's odd. Alright, Ash, you're gonna come with me. Where's my flyer? Uh oh, where's Angel? Sky Blast. Oh, great. Cannot lose Angel. I don't see her anywhere. Oh, she's the most important thing. Alright, we gotta go back for Angel. We just have to. 
Ash is able to. Oh, it feels so good to be done with those Bronos. I can actually move. All right, let's keep our eyes peeled for Angel. Oh, crap, crap, crap. Yeah, I did turn on uh, God mode because I kept dying from fall damage, and uh, it just got beyond annoying. So, just don't want to deal with that anymore. If I could just specifically turn off fall damage, I definitely would. Oh man, where's Angel? Did Angel die? There's no way Angel died. Angel! Huh. Can't imagine where she'd be other than over here. Interesting, interesting. Oh boy. Oh well. You know what? If I lost the Argentavis, then I lost her. She was a really good one, though. Crap. Well. Freaking Bronos. Oh well, they're worth it. We got a buildable... We got a mother... Sh oh, there she is. Angel. You're following me. Oh, you're stuck. Yep. Yeah, and this is really the downfall of Ark in my mind. Is things getting stuck on trees. It really is a nuisance. I'm not just being particular here. It's quite annoying. Alright, so we got Angel back. That's good. Not good enough. Um, our Brontos are roaming around. Our Raptors are roaming around. Yeah, everything's good. Everything's good in the world. We're going to deal with Mothership and do some more base building another day. This is going to be the end of this episode. We got our Brontos back home. We've got three now. We're probably going to build some more saddles and experiment with different kind of um, bases. I definitely want one to be a mobile atrium or atriary or whatever the word is for birds. And then, oops, I forgot about Angel. Um, Ash is good. You can just fly in and out anytime you want. But Angel, I, have to, I actually have to guide in a particular direction. Where does she go? There she is. All right, cool. So let's fly up, 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 and then down, 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 down. She should be able to follow. Me. Here she comes. Perfect. Just <laughs> land right on top. All right, good job, Angel. Despite getting lost, you are pretty freaking awesome. You have no meat on you, though. That's a little concerning. Oh, I got rid of it all. I put it all on the raptor. Sky blast? Nope. Really? There we go. I knew one of you had some meat. Why don't you share? I need to put a feeding trough up here. Alright. You might just have to start being an omnivore. Sorry, angel. Sky Blast, a little bit of meat, okay. Let's grab Ash, nope. Let's grab Ash, the other Ash, there we go. Let's go in our door. Here we go Ash. See if we can't guide it home. Yep, we got it, okay. Oh, there is a feeding trough. I wonder if it goes up to the roof. I don't even know. I wonder if there's any meat in there. There's not. There's a bunch of spoiled meat. Well, that's one way to get spoiled meat, is just... Why don't you land? Oh yeah, you can level up. Hmm. Hmm. Movement speed. Movement speed is just too good. Here's my little walkway that I built. That's very handy. All right, and that's a wrap. Uh, thank you for watching. I hope you enjoyed. And what else do I need to do? Did it just say spoiled, spoiled meat? Does spoiled meat spoil? Is that a thing? Are you serious? Spoils in four minutes. Spoiled meat spoils. Okay, well, all right. I guess it gets too spoiled for even spoiling. I don't even know. Whatevs. That doesn't make sense to me, but I guess that's a thing. All right, let's do this. Well, I guess I need more narco berries then, don't I? Eh, it's not. It's not really. You get so much spoiled meat. It's out of control. So, don't care. All right, there's that. You know what? Let's uh, off camera. I'm gonna craft some narco arrows. I don't really care about regular arrows. 
So that's what I'm going to do. Thank you for watching. I hope you enjoyed this episode. Um, I know it was just moving the dinos back and forth and taming some new stuff and things. We did a little bit of building. We died a few times, but most importantly, we got everyone home. And next time we're going to really dig into building. And then I think we're going to just go on journeys to find the packy. Uh, thank you for watching. I hope you enjoyed. We'll do the whole thing. And uh, we will play again soon. Have a good night. Bye.